demand, by popular demand, we're bringing back the bunkhouse report. Today is Monday, February 13th, 2023, and it's time for the news that's important to you. Colts, Valentine's Day is tomorrow, so make sure to dress in red and pink. Clubs for today include the Connect Four Club and Creative Games Club, which meet with Mr. Trejo and student services after school. The Disc Golf Club meets with Mr. Gajeki and Mr. Owens after school on the blacktop. Eighth graders, in today's announcements, we will not be reminding you to purchase, purchase your Knots ticket or promotion dance tickets. We know you have heard enough of us last week. This is a reminder for all teachers that your Leading the Way nomination is due this coming Wednesday. ASB and Renaissance are excited to celebrate our cults at the Leading the Way luncheon on Friday, February 24th. As part of Black History Month, we want to introduce everyone to Sidney Poitier, who was born in 1927 and died in 2022. He was a Bahamian and American actor, film director, and diplomat, who was the first black actor and first Bahamian to win the Academy Award for Best Actor in a Leading Role. In 1967, Poitier delivered three very different yet equally strong performances. He played Philadelphia detective Virgil Tibbs in the southern crime drama In the Heat of the Night. In Guess Who's Coming to Dinner, he played a black man engaged to a white woman in this groundbreaking look at interracial marriage. In 1972, Poitier made his directorial debut and co-starred with his friend Harry Belafonte in the western Buck and the Preacher. In 1980, Poitier helmed the Richard Pryor, Gene Wilder comedy, Sir Crazy, which became the highest grossing film by an African-American director for many years. Mr. Poitier was quoted as saying, Our humanity is served back to us through the eyes of those who have diminished us, and they serve back to us as a view of ourselves that is incomplete. If we don't look to the bigger picture, our view will narrow to that which is constantly fed to us. That's it for the news that you need to know today, Colts. Have a great day leading the way.